Hey gang. So why is it that the last sort of five to 10 pounds or that stubborn stuff is so hard to get rid of? Basically, the more and more weight you lose or the leaner somebody gets, the harder it is to get rid of that body fat. So somebody starting at say, um, six feet, 300 pounds, for example, starting their fat loss journey, or somebody starting at six feet, you know, 185 pounds, um, assuming that their builds are the same, roughly same person, it's the 300 pound person is gonna have a much faster rate of fat loss, so they're gonna lose a lot more weight quicker than the person at 185, but you need to think about it as a percentage of total weight as opposed to the total amount of weight you're losing. So someone at 300 pounds can drop, you know, maybe even five pounds a week for, for a little bit just because they have so much to lose. But that person at 185 losing two pounds a week is still losing a big percentage of their total weight. So the leaner and leaner we get, the tougher and tougher it is to, to lose body fat. And also that's just because of the body kicking back in as far as, you know, um, the body doesn't want to be ultra lean because having a little bit of body fat on you means um, if there's a famine, for example, you're gonna have uh, more fuel on your body to survive. So it's basically an evolutionary mechanism or su evolutionary survival mechanism as well kicking in there. But just think about it as a percentage of total weight as opposed to, you know, you're at 185 compare comparing your weight loss weekly to somebody at 300 pounds. It's not quite apples to apples. So those are a few reasons why it, uh, those, those shifts, they're, they're a little bit different as far as the person at 300 versus 185. So if you have any questions about that, hit me up and I hope that helped guys. See ya.